Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. So today I'll be showing you how to change your profiles in Razer Synapse based on the game or application that you're in. So really quick before the video starts, over 99% of the people who watch my videos are not subscribed. So if you're part of that 99%, please consider subscribing. It's completely free. And when you do subscribe, make sure you click on the bell next to the subscribe button. Anyway, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is open up Razer Synapse. So here I have my mouse with my profile. And I just want to make it clear that this will only work for Razer Mice because you can only add Razer Mice to Razer Synapse and you need Razer Synapse for this to work. So once you've connected uh, your mouse here, um, if you want to check out other videos about uh, Razer Synapse, I have other videos. I can show you how to do that. I'll put a link um, at the end of the video and in the top right corner. So what I'm going to show you is how to make it so that this, this uh, Razer Synapse will automatically change your mouse profile when you open up a new application or program or game. Um, so you can see I have a few profiles here. And so I may want the a profile to change based on what uh, program I'm using. For example, my editing profile would be when I'm doing my editing software, or my games would be when I'm playing a game, or Simplex would just be like Chrome or something regular. So what do you want to do to set that up is go to profiles right here. And here you have uh, all your profiles. In my case, I have four different profiles. You can see I've linked my editing um, profile to my editing software. I've linked my games profile to one of my games. And um, I'm going to show you how to uh, add a new one. So as you can see, I have my Simplex profile here. So if I want to link a game, I can click on this link right here. And it shows all the different games that I have. Um, and you can it doesn't even have to be a game. It can also just be a program. And if you want to um, use a program, you click on Add right here. And um, you can go through all of your different programs. Or if you click on Browse, it'll take you to your File Explorer. And you can look through your Windows C folder to try to find uh, the exe file of the program that you want um, to link. So once you find the program that you want, I'm just going to use Chrome, right, which is already here. And you just click on Link. And now it has linked this profile to this uh, program or this game. So now I'm going to show you an example. So I just switched my profile to my editing editing profile. And now if I minimize this, I go to Google Chrome. You will see that um, it should pop up and say that my profile has changed to Simplex. And if I were to go and open one of the other programs that I um, linked here, it would change it back. And you can see as soon as I exit Chrome, it changes back to what I set it to manually. So for example, if I had it on Simplex, and then I opened up my editing software. Um, it would change to editing, and then once I closed my editing software, it would change back to Simplex. So that's a pretty useful feature. And just as a bonus feature, you can also uh, change your lighting based on what program you're in. So you can see I have all of these different effects right here. So say I want to link this to a certain game. Maybe you want to link your sound-based lighting, which I made a video on before. Maybe you want to link that to your like Spotify or Apple Music. Um, then that could be something you could do. I'm just going to link it to this because it's the first one that's there. I can link uh, my blue color to um, Google Chrome. And um, I can't show you, but when you change to that um, application, it will change the lighting on your mouse or your keyboard or whatever you're using. So yeah, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, uh, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, and comment. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.